So we're going to live in a world like this. We all have our little agents doing things for us. And this will fu fundamentally change everything. And 80% of all the jobs in 10 years are not even invented yet today. We're going to live in a world where we make new jobs, hopefully. We're going to live in a world where 50% of all the new jobs will be in the cloud online. They will not be on location. So you can use AI to create funny pictures. I like to turn myself into an AI. El mundo de los datos no es el mundo real. Es una distinción importante. El mundo de los datos es un mundo basado en la lógica. Cualquier IA a la que le pidas que tome en But consideración not, cualquier... Be bad, the best thing is it makes me look good. Intelligence assistance makes great tools that we must use. It may make a companion that we maybe should not use. <laughs> Or maybe a little bit, but I don't want to go to a therapist. That's my AI. But maybe a little bit of a companion is fine, especially for younger people. We do not want this. The AI to be the master. When it makes up our schedule, tells us what to do, we get really lazy. We become superfluous. The CEO of OpenAI says the future of AI is machines that have capacity to think, to create, to understand, and to reason. Do you want your machine to understand, create, and reason like we do? I don't want this. I want the machine to just do the work. This is where we are going. We're all going to have software that helps us do our work. That's already true, but just give it a few more years, and we're not talking about 10 years here. We're talking about a year or two. Cesar Manrique, right? the purpose of a country, a state, the number one purpose is to further the education of its people. Are we doing that today? We're clearly not. Because what we teach people is to learn the stuff that was important 10 years ago. Like programming. Is programming important? No. The machines can program themselves. What is important? Understanding people. Being creative. Actually doing things. Making real connections. What's happening now is computers are getting smart and they're learning how to do this. Intellectual knowledge. And we may not like it. We may not... Appreciate it, but this is what's happened. And uh, we're not going back. Machines are understanding, they have logic, knowledge, they have much better data, and now this pyramid is moving up. This is where we are going. To all the other work, purpose, wisdom, understanding, tacit knowledge, negotiation, creativity. We have to get better at understanding technology and using it, creating things, and at the same time to understand humans. And then it's wide open.